Hey guys, welcome back. Bodie 101 here. We're back in the world of galactic science, picking up a little bit after we left off. So last episode, we were kind of working with uh, some new power sources, and I made this room back here. And I'll kind of explain what this is. And as you notice, all of our little sterling generators have gone a bye-bye, and that is awesome. So we basically have this gas turbine uh, system here has a steel turbine, gas turbine controller, and a fluid intake, and then also a flux generator, which is how we get power out. So basically this runs on rocket fuel. Fuel is in, produces power, and then I have it, uh, one line coming off this way, leads, uh, I can't get back there. Let's see, Let's see if we can poke in here a little bit. So this basically just leads off, kind of cleaned up our wires a little bit, and um, yeah, and then we have our vat here. We have water automatically coming in. We're using cellulose and carbon, which is just from coal and from like wood or, or uh, um, leaves or anything like that broken down. Pretty easy stuff and it's making hooch. And that hooch goes in here. There's actually a tank that goes in behind the wall back here. So it's a double tank. And then uh, what I can do is then I just pull this off pull this down here, connect this to here, and then I add in uh, gunpowder and redstone with the hooch here, and it makes rocket fuel. So there we go. We got ourselves a good source of power. We are having no problem. This is running great. I reset up our machines, clean them up a little bit, and uh, yeah, we should be good to go. So, so there's that. Uh, we still have this going, making us plenty of lava, um, and yeah. So, let's pop into our book real quick, see if there's anything that we... Eh, let's have one quest that was claimed. So, we've been working a lot with the power stuff, uh, the more power, and there's still a lot more to kind of get into in this. Um, but I want to kind of look at some of the other quests. So... <sighs> This is something, like I said, I think I just need to, like, get a ridiculous amount of resources. Um, we're doing pretty decent. I did go through and take care of some ingots. Um, I may, at some point, make another sieve. Maybe make an auto, um, uh, what you call it, uh, obsidian generator with these set that up give ourselves a little bit more room and be able to do that so but for right now this is kind of fulfilling what we need um <clears throat> so really not worried about that these i'm really not going to be using i'm okay just switching out my air tanks but we'll make those in due time so um and then we have here this is probably what we're going to work in a little bit today um, this episode, maybe a little bit in the next episode, just because these are relatively easy tasks and, the, and there's some things I'd like to kind of get into in this. Um, we do have some more work to do in here, so maybe we'll work in that a little bit as well. So, all right. So for this one, let's kind of just, let's kind of take a step back and get into storage solutions a little bit. No, that's not what I, is that what I wanted? Actually, this one. Why do all the work? Yeah. All right, so we have a whole progressive automation line here that we really haven't messed with, and I think we should. It'll definitely help us out. So automatic timber basically makes us to want, wants us to make a wooden chopper. Okay, so let's go ahead and work on this. Um, this is a pretty cool mod. So it has, it's, you know, progressive automation, so it's different automation. These are all different choppers. Uh, wooden chopper, stone chopper, iron chopper, and diamond chopper, and so on and so forth. And we're going to kind of work our way up through these. So we're going to need some um, regular wood, furnace, chest, and a wooden axe. So let's go ahead and get ourselves a decent amount of wood. And I don't have any cobble in here, so let's grab some cobble from here. All right, so um, let's go ahead and do this. Go ahead and make ourselves our axe real quick. There we go. Let's go ahead and make ourselves a chest. 
There we go. And we'll go ahead and make ourselves this bad boy. All right, so that goes there. That goes there. Now, we're going to make some of these and probably not use them just because we kind of have to go up through the tiers. So that gives us a wooden chopper. And that gives us some saplings and some coal. Cool. All right, so let's get into this one. Uh, the stone chopper. We're just going to kind of blaze through these as quick as we can. So, um, all right. So let's go ahead and move that out of the way. Let's grab ourselves some of our stone we have cooked up here. And then we're going to use the one we just made. Oh, I should actually make the axe first. Okay. All right. So that and that. This one's pretty easy. Up and around. And boom. There we go. All right. And it does that. I like what war bags. War bags are my friends. All right, so iron chopper. So you can kind of see, I'm just kind of blazing through these real quick. So ugh, this takes a lot of iron, but okay, let's do this. Let's get rid of all that stupid axe. Shut up, zombie. I hear you. And you know what? Deep down, don't care. Do I have more iron cooking? Go away. Um, mm, 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 hmm. Okay, apparently I don't have more iron. But something kind of cool will come out of this here in a second. So, um, all right. So, iron chopper, we are going to uh, need ourselves some more sticks. Let's go ahead and make ourselves one of these bad boys. This is probably going to hit our iron pretty rough here. Make a block. That's the worst part right there. Ugh. All right. That and that and that. And then come like this. And we got ourselves one iron chopper. Perfect. So we'll go ahead and claim this one. And then finally, the diamond chopper. And as you guessed, it's a whole lot of diamonds. So let's go ahead and put this back. Let's go ahead and grab some diamonds. Perfect. All right. And like so... And this is actually going to be the one that we're going to actually use. But there's a couple more things that we're going to need to kind of run through here to do this. So, there is our diamond chopper. And that gets us a diamond axe. Uh, carbon nanotubes. Hmm, that's interesting. Okay. Very interesting. Let's keep all the... Oh, no, it gave us all the axes. All right, let's go put this away. And we'll figure out what the heck that's for later. Put that right there. Perfect. Okay. So, <clears throat> with these choppers, and we'll go set set this up up top here in a second. But, um, with these choppers, really, when you just set it down, and I'll kind of show you. If you set this down, you can see that all the sides are blank except for, obviously, the top, which is an output, and this one right here. So, as of right now... This can only chop down a tree that's planted right here, okay? So you can't put trees around it or anything else. But if you wanted to be able to do more trees at one time, you need to get into these, the upgrades. So we're going to kind of run through a bunch of these um, like we just did. And there's... Uh, there's a cool little trick we're going to kind of pull off here. So how many do we need to make? We need to make... Oh, we don't have to make one. Okay. So let's get ourselves a little bit of redstone. Perfect. All right. And we do that. And this zombie. Seriously, I don't care. So that gives us the wooden one. Not all that exciting. Now, here is... That uh, gives us ten wooden ones. Here's the thing with these. Wooden upgrades... That you can only use them in wooden choppers, stone to stone, iron to iron. So since we have a diamond uh, chopper, these three here aren't really going to help us all that much. So we're not going to. We're just let's once again. We're just going to kind of burn through these. But like I said, I have a little trick I'm going to use once we get through these. So stone surrounded by, and just like doing the upgrades, it's taking the original and then just putting stuff around it to make the next one okay there's that one yay we did it we're we're big boys now we're big boys all right let's put that up there 
All right, and then the next one is going to be iron. And I know this is probably super exciting, guys, but it's kind of something we want to work with. Plus, I want to try and get a little bit more wood. So there's that, there's that, there's that. Gives us the iron one. And put that away. And there's this one. Perfect. We're flying through this one. All right, and then uh, the last one will be, of course, the diamond one, which is... Oh, it's only two diamonds. That's not bad. All right, we take one of these, and we do... Wait, what was it? It was up here, right? And then we do this and this. All right, perfect. So we got that. We come, and we claim this one. This gives us ten of those, plus two stable unstable ingots. Yes, stable. Yay. All right. So those are cool. All right. So here's, uh, well, let's let's keep kind of looking through here. So what they want us to make is a wooden planter, a wooden killer, a mob filter upgrade, and an RF engine. But what I'm going to do, and once again, since we're, we're going to be using this one and that one, but not the rest of these, if I come over here, and this is the little trick, if I throw these in here... You're going to see us starting to get a bunch of iron out of them. Look at this. And cellulose, which we are using, plus a little zinc. So that's kind of cool. So as you can see, we are starting to get a ton of iron. Let's actually grab the cellulose out of here and this carbon. All right, let's go put this stuff away real quick. So that's the kind of cool part is, and that is one of the neatest things about the... Um, do I not have this here? There it is. Wait, that's not it. Is that it? That's it. Um, that's one of the kind of cooler parts about this. The the chemical decomposer is, is and it's kind of a way to kind of get back stuff that we shouldn't have made. You know what I'm saying? So, all right. So I'm just trying to get as much of the iron out of here because it's taking up the most space. We'll throw it over in here. So this will help us get back some of the iron we just spent to make all this stuff. Now keep in mind, each stack, uh, I think, is going to be, what, four ingots? So it looks like, uh, you know, a lot more than it actually is. Let's see, we're still cooking through them here. There's some there. So, you know, we're not necessarily going to get it all back, but we're definitely going to get quite a bit back of what we spent. Uh, let's do this. See, we almost have a full thing here. All right, let's see. That should be about it. Uh, okay, let's throw this in here. And so we got 60 ingots. So the funny part is, with that quest line, we actually came out ahead because we only had 61 when we started. So that's pretty cool. So, all right. <clears throat> um, so let's go ahead and go up and play a little bit with this chopper real quick. Kind of get this set up and show you what it does. Uh, so let's go ahead and take this out. And then we're going to put the, the chopper right here. Okay. And then we're going to put in, I'm going to just put in all of these. Okay. And then we put in our saplings. We put in an axe. And then we put in some coal for power. And as you can see, it is chopping down the tree for us, which is pretty cool. And everything is going in here. Um, any of the saplings will go there. Now, the kind of interesting part we can kind of keep mind of, if we, say, stop paying attention to this thing and we run out of coal, it will then start putting its own oak wood in there to charge it. So... We really don't have to worry about this. And it replanted. Um, and now you guys can see, if you notice around it, all of the sides have a little black box. So it actually has a range of 23. So if we added more dirt, we could actually add more trees. So Oh, also, I don't know if I showed you guys this. I think I did it between the last episode. I tried to make... Oh, I guess it did work. This is the first time I found anything inside of here. And I think it's because I built it a little too close because technically I'm just right under here, so I'm not that far, so. All right, there we go. So we got ourselves our, our, our wood chopper. Uh, I mean, it's pretty automated. Ooh, okay, there we go. All right, 
not going to get in your way. Um, now I don't need, and I can actually means I can take out most of these trees because these are just extra ones here. Maybe I'll infest these ones, and I could make another one of these if I want. Just well, it would cut down the infested trees before they got infested. So never mind. All right, so let's uh, switch out our air tanks real quick. Ah, uh, good fresh breath, fresh air. All right, so let's finish things off. Let's actually open these reward bags that we got. Uh, let's go ahead and do this one. So this is, so we got, what, a greater. Let's actually open the good ones first, so. All right. Oh, spawn cow. That's kind of cool. Spawn cow. That's kind of cool. The only problem, eh, oil field can't stop that. The only problem with the um, spawning of animals is that, um, what else I put in here? Oh, yeah, this is that uh, unless we can see do an oxygen sealer and seal this place in, uh, they will die because they will not have oxygen. And then my girlfriend will yell at me because I let the cows. Die. It's a whole thing. It's we don't want to get into it. It's a whole thing is what I'm trying to say. So, but we are definitely coming along here. So we got ourselves what I would consider some pretty solid stable power. Um, pretty much just being made off these chemicals. See, this thing was already kind of filling up so we could probably pull most of the stuff out and let that do its thing and then um so yeah you know we got ourselves a solid source of power we are getting a little bit into chemicals uh we do have the auto chopper and that was something i've been wanting to get to for a while so we might work in some of the other quest lines in the next episode i just want to try and get through those and then like i said you know we were able to break things down we did get some other stuff some magnesium oxides magnesium silicone zinc uh more cellulose we can use uh some lead copper you know not a lot but a little bit of stuff here i think if we break this down it actually get oxygen copper and uh iron so all right, guys, well, we're going to wrap things up there. I think in the next episode, we're going to get a little bit more. Maybe we're going to do some more of this. We're going to do some more of the chemical decomposer and stuff and see if we can uh, make this. I've already started working on this. So, But all right, guys, wait. Well, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Questions, comments, concerns, put it down in the comment section. And until the next episode of Galactic Science, I want to thank you guys ever so much for hanging out, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!